In my lifetime, I've witnessed a terrible decline. In yours, you could and should witness a wonderful recovery. That desperate hope is why the world is looking to you and why you are here. Either we stop it or it stops us. And it's time to say enough. Enough of brutalizing biodiversity. Enough of killing ourselves with carbon. Enough of treating nature like a toilet. Enough of burning and drilling and mining our way deeper. We are digging our own graves. Right now, as we sit comfortably here in this conference center in Glasgow, over two million of my fellow Kenyans are facing climate-related starvation. While you are closing your eyes to reality, my friend, since I was a kid, was murdered for protecting the forest. Of over, wait for it, of over $12 billion. A $2 billion pledge. Over $130 trillion. So I ask to you, what must we say to our people living on the front line in the Caribbean, in Africa, in Latin America, in the Pacific, when both ambition and regrettably some of the needed faces at Glasgow are not present. Scientists are clear on the facts. Leaders must be as clear in their actions. 